I'm, I'm building a survey right now um, and I'm using the matrix yeah. option. Mm -hmm. And I was wondering if there's a way to have the things that are listed change order based on different people taking the survey. Like if I can randomize that list at all. You can. Awesome. So there is a, uh, uh, since you're new, you may not be familiar with external modules. So, hey man, do you have a second since you're, you're demoing? Can you show her the external module real quick yep. for random? I'll, I'll go into the project one so that way she can see how to do it. Oh, good, good. Thank you. Thank you. So with the external modules, so this would be, there's a random, uh, the matrix field randomization module. Um, and what you would do is uh, you would set, you would go into this external modules menu option here, and then you would enable a module. And this gives you a list of all the modules that are available. And we'll just type in matrix. So matrix question randomization, you would just enable this and it shows up here. And then you would have um, some configuration here. So we would set a group name. So I think I have a project that already does this. So let me see. So Jenna, if you're not familiar with the external modules, these are all plugins that enhance the uh, use of REDCap. So um, you wouldn't know that they exist unless you poke around on external modules. And we try to put these videos out there uh, to help you, but I'm glad you didn't agonize over this and you, and you came and asked. So, sorry, go ahead, May. No problem. And so uh, we just ha I have this demo here that I created and it's already, enabled and then you just configure it. All you have to do is put in which matrix group you want to randomize. And if you have an, if you have multiple groups that you want to randomize, you would just click this plus sign and then type in the next name, you know, so you would have, you could add as many as you want. Uh, so it's this CW social influence. Um, so we'll just hit save here. And if I go to the code book, you can see the, um, Make sure it's the right one. Oh yeah, so it's this, it's the, this is the, the each, this is each question, but the, the whole group is called the social influence. Uh, so if we just go to the survey, you'll see here that uh, people whose opinions that I value prefer that I use it is the first one. And if I refresh, um, it should, there you go. So now the first one is the university strongly recommends it. And if I go back to the link uh, and click again, you'll see that it, it randomizes. So every time the survey opens, it's randomizing this group of questions um, in this matrix. Awesome. That's exactly what I needed. Thank you, guys. And, and, yep. ju and just to be sure, man, can you go ahead and show her where the uh, name of the matrix is, because it isn't sure. real obvious. Sure. So in the designer, when we go to the, if you go, if you, it's up here at the top where it says matrix group, and it's, and if you go into the edit, it's down here at the bottom this matrix group name is the field you want. Okay, perfect. And uh, as Terry mentioned, when we do these red zones, if we demo something, we, we like to record them and, and put them up on our website. And so our website is, is here and we've got like a huge list wow. of videos. Awesome. Um, and I'll throw this in the chat for you. Thank you so much.